This is the Basha Show one and one Welcome to part four of my interview with international cricketer and legend, Christopher Rupofu. You know, if, if you looked at our last segment, you know, it's your girl Basha coming back to you with my friend, Christopher Bobby Mpofu. I have to do the highlight that to get it. Mpofu, all right. You know, uh, my African king, my, my really good friend, um, this guy always inspires Ricardo and I and, and other people in our circle, in the cricket circle. You know, always has a smile on his face. And I think we all know why now the, the man has surrendered his, his life to God totally. He goes fishing and he waits on the Lord. <laughs> to, you know, he spends his past time fishing, relaxing. <laughs> so if you want to know the secret to success, trust God more, go fishing <laughs> and learn to laugh. How about that? That's a lesson I needed this week. It's been a rough week for me, you know. We're all here in Qatar. Yeah getting our life together and, and, and doing great things. But it's, you know, some, somehow to pick up on our last segment, yeah. when you decide that you want to do great things, yeah. this is how we were all raised, right? Yeah. It, it, you, you seem to think that, hey, if you need to make a team, if you need to do this, you have to train hard, work hard. But think of the millions of people who are actually working hard. That is very true. That is very true. And some of them not getting through because? If you don't have God... That's just how I, I feel like if you don't have someone to push you to, and that person for me is, is, is my Lord Jesus. That like, higher power. Exactly. That's, mm -hmm. that's what I have. And I trust You can him. all call him by different names. Yeah, exactly. You, you so, yeah. It's all you, like my mom always tells me one thing that you, it's up to you at the end of the day, what are you going to use to get to wherever you want to go? People yeah. use different ways, but different I ways. found my yeah. way that, God is my way to, to and get to my And you say you have this. a peace from this. This is what gives you the peace to know that everything's going to be okay. Like I said, the first thing that I, I I wake up in the morning sometimes where you realize that the pocket is not is not full. But if you've got peace in you, that's the most important pocket that you have there. Yeah, because there are a lot peace. of people who have a lot of money and no peace. People who've got millions that don't and actually peace. even go to sleep. So I would rather have God and go to sleep peacefully. Yeah. Than to have not, not that you wouldn't want the money, yeah. but you want God first. <laughs> first let's be, let's be clear. Exactly. You know, as, a, we, as a legend agent, <laughs> as a legend, you know, you need to tell them how you gave me the name legend agent. The name legend agent came from this man here, Christopher Bobby Fofu. Tell them why you gave me the name legend agent. For me, yes. you don't find most of the amazing women like her who do amazing work that she has at a, as an agent so for me it was easy for, to, to, for me to say that's the legend who is an agent at the same time so big up to that she has always been my legend agent you, you make me laugh every time <laughs> i say it because at one point i really didn't know what my real title was right because <laughs> he started calling me legend agent everybody was calling me legend agent in india and then you flipped it on me and you decided to say Agent legend. legend. I'm like, what is my name? <laughs> so what's the real name? <laughs> your, your name? Yeah. I'll still stick to Agent Legend. Agent Legend. Okay, yeah, exactly. so it's Agent Legend. Exactly. Personally, I like Legend Agent. I don't know why. She's it's better, Agent Legend. Agent Legend. <laughs> but Christopher says it's Agent Legend. Exactly. So we're going with that. So when you see me in these streets, call me Agent Legend. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. You know, before you go, yeah. and you know you have to come back, you know, I just love, I can't, you know, tell you how much I enjoy. You're so infectious. You're positive vibes. I enjoy talking with you. I can sit here all day, go fishing, <laughs> talking with you. But Ricardo might get jealous, so we won't do yeah. that. But anyways, you know, you have to dance. You can't come on the Basha show right. and not dance with me. Okay. So I think in the spirit of cricket, we could we could dance to to the song of the great Dwayne Bravo, but champion. Okay. The, the Asian legend, legend and the champion. African king. Yeah, exactly. Together we champions, <laughs> right? Exactly. So we champion can dance the champion. No worries. All right. So if you want to see this dance, you got to head to Instagram and Facebook and so on, or blog, bashatv.com to see me and my friend, and TikTok to see me and my friend, <laughs> Buffo, <laughs> do the dance, all right? You got that right. And I promise you all, I can dance better than the last time you saw me dancing. Because, you know, I'm grown and sexy now. All right. Let's go. Thank get you it. for coming through. Thank you so much, Let's sister. See you soon. Bless you. All Thank right. you. All right. Bless you too, brother. That's a wrap. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs>